guys. So today's video is going to be me flat ironing my hair. Just flat ironing my hair in front of the camera for you. And I'll just talk a bit about what's going on in my life while I do this. So this is what my hair looks like because yesterday I um did a hot oil treatment. I actually did a hot oil treatment overnight Friday night. And then I today's today's Monday. Friday night I did a hot oil treatment overnight. And then I washed my hair. Neek, bring him inside. He's being too loud. The dog's being loud and he's getting on my nerves. But um yeah, I did a, the hot oil treatment overnight. Washed my hair in the morning. And then I did a deep conditioning treatment. I don't know how long I kept the conditioner in. Probably an hour. But um, then I wore it curly to church yesterday. And now this is what it looks like. I have some serum in it, so I'm not putting anything extra in it. And then I've got my coffee for this video. <laughs> Pretty good. I just now tasted it, you guys, after I made it. I told her to bring him inside, but she didn't listen. She went out there with him, which is okay, I guess, because he does need time outside. My hair is growing already. You guys see the roots? And I apologize if the lighting is not that good for this video, you guys. I was sitting over there in that seat, which the lighting was a lot better. But I had to switch because flat iron unplugged sitting over there so let's just get into it let me figure out where i'm gonna start i better start by getting the knots out with this brush and this is a revlon flat iron i got i looked on the let go app to see if who had if anybody had flat irons for sale. And I got this brand new for $10, y'all. I was gonna go to the store and pay $25, $30 for a new flat iron. That's how much this cost at Target. But I got it for $10 brand new. Straight out the box. The reason I went on let go is because my husband, he was like, You never like to look on the apps. You like to buy stuff brand new and pay more. So I'm definitely glad that I listened to him this time. Um, I know my voice sounds a little froggy and scratchy or whatever. Everybody, all of the kids are coughing. Reese been coughing for days. He had a fever. It went down because I put cool rags under his arms at night. And so it went down the next day. And I'm going to start in the back, you guys. So this is what I'm going to do. Start in the back. But he's still coughing. The knee came. And she's coughing over the place. And now Heaven's coughing since knee came. Now I got a cold. And when I get a cold, it lasts for like two weeks. So I'm a little annoyed. Yeah. But anyway. Besides the cold, all is well. And the kids don't have school today. So let me see. Get a little more coffee. Heaven's coming. Let's see what she wants. Me. Huh? We did what? Me. I'm not sure what you're talking about. Recently, please leave her alone. See how straight that one pass got my hair? Sometimes I do, on some pieces I do two passes, but most pieces I do one pass with this flat iron and it gets straight. I know in my last video I told y'all I was going to dye my hair once the baby comes. And 
I'm not sure if I will or not. I might, I might not. some clips. I'm just using this um, hair tie. What do you guys call them? You call them hair ties? You call them ponytails? You call them elastics? I don't know. What do you call them? I just say hair tie. <laughs> Can't wait for the baby to come, you guys. Got about three and a half months left. Got about three and a half months. Got the whole of April, the whole of May, the whole of June, and then into July. So hopefully he'll wait till full term I pray that he waits till full term Reese was born about three days before his due date so that's full term um heaven was born was it on her due date yeah because I was induced at 40 weeks with heaven so let's see what this baby does What's heaven doing upstairs, Reese? Nothing. Tell her to come downstairs. Go downstairs. So I know I haven't told you guys yet, but I am working as a home health aide. I don't know if I talked about that in one of my old videos, one of my older videos, but right now I'm working as a home health aide. I only have one client right now, and I work part-time, I work 25 hours a week, and I'm hoping to be able to work through June um, when this baby is born, we are planning on moving. So we're starting to look for a place. We already have been looking for a place. But the closer that it gets to summer, probably be easier to find a place. We are applying for a home ownership program, assistance program. Heaven, come downstairs. I'm sorry, you guys. I didn't want to have to yell during this video, so I tried to put something on for her, but she's still not listening. But anyway, um, so we're planning on moving and um, owning a home. So if you know the word of prayer and you are, you know, somebody who prays, please pray for us. I'm back. I had to pause the video to go. Talked to heaven, she went and put stuff all over her face and in her hair from the bathroom. I hate it when she does that mess. Do you guys little girls go in the bathroom when you're not looking and play in there? Anyway, I know I was talking about us moving. And I'm praying that the Lord blesses this move. If not, we're not moving. I believe that it will happen if it's meant to happen. Things will fall into place. We'll find a place and we'll be good. 
If not, we'll stay in Reading. <laughs> So yeah, um, just pray for us about the house. Other than that, and looking forward to the baby. Oh yeah, I was gonna tell you, um, that's what I was about to say. The kids distracted me. I was trying to do this video uninterrupted, but they wanna get into stuff. Um, after the baby is born, I'm, as soon as I can, I'm going to be taking uh, CNA classes and getting certified so I can get paid more and, you know, have more job opportunities. And I think I eventually want to become an LPN. Yeah. So that's what I'm looking forward to, you guys. The baby. Moving and getting CNA certified. So that's me. I made him go upstairs and take a nap. <laughs> so, I'm just gonna finish flat ironing my hair. I don't want to go through this whole video with my whole head. It doesn't take that long, you guys. Like, I used to, when I used to flat iron my hair, like years ago when I used to do the whole thing, every once in a while, it would take me like an hour or more to do my whole head. I don't know if it was because I had longer hair or if it was curlier i think i did have curlier hair than i do now or if the flat iron wasn't that good but now it only takes hmm, maybe 20 minutes a half hour to do my whole head which isn't bad at all like i said at the beginning of the video i only have to do like one pass for each chunk of hair I do. So that's good. One of my next videos is going to be the um the video about what hair products I use, which I do not use a lot of hair products, you guys. But just let me finish and I'll come back and show you the results. <laughs> okay, so I'm all done. As you can see, I switched backgrounds. I went to the other chair where the better lighting is. Um, sometimes when I flat iron my air, hair, I like do a flip, like wrap the flat iron around like that. So there's like a curl to it. But I didn't do that this time. I just wanted it straightened. So how do you guys think it turned out? It took about half hour maybe to do the whole head. There's my little bangs in the front but that's all i'm doing with it today you guys i'm just gonna style it into place and yeah that's it if you guys have any questions about anything that i was talking about or comments about us moving the baby or uh, me getting certified as a cna then just let me down know down below and if you have any videos that you want to see from me Maybe question answer video. I don't get too many comments on my videos yet. So I don't really have any questions that people have been asking me yet. I could just make up some questions. Um, yeah, let me know if there's anything specific that you guys want to see. And I will see you in the next video. If you haven't subscribed yet and you're enjoying my content, subscribe so you can see what's coming next. And like this video if you enjoyed. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.